Hello, all you wonderful people in LinkedIn land. It is Monday, March 7th, and it is time for market statistics. And I hope you had a phenomenal weekend. Saturday was beautiful. I walked out on the trail. I hope you were able to get outside and enjoy the sun on your face and the warmth. It was fantastic. Today, it's pretty rainy and nasty, but that's okay. You know what? As long as we had a nice weekend, that's what matters. And bonus today is market statistics day so i'm going to be talking to you about the market the monongahela county real estate market the month of february 2022 versus the month of february 2021 for those of you who have watched this before you know i always compare uh single family detached houses and single family attached houses differently separately um so got all my numbers right here are you ready let's go so Single family detached houses, February of 2021, there were 49 units sold with an average days on market of 91 and an average sales price of 326,949. Last month, February of 2022, there were 60 units sold, so that's an increase of a little over 22%. They sold 25% faster with an average of 68 days and the uh, sales price went up just a little over 2% to 334,755. So single family attached houses, which is townhouses and condos, those in February of 2021, there were 28 units sold with an average of 102 days on market and an average sales price of 198,660. Last month, significantly lower in sales, a 46% drop to 15 units, but they sold almost 56% faster with 45 days on market and 17% higher in value of 232,445. Now, I got curious because now we are in two years in a row of really, really, really um, high, um, uh, excuse me, really, really high volume sales going very, very quickly. And so I wanted to compare to like back in normal days, you know, like, so long ago in 2017. So I went back to 2017, which I remember being a good year, a good solid year in real estate. Um, so I wanted to look at the units and the days on market. So listen to this. So I just said for single family detached houses, there were 60 units sold in February. There were 30 units sold in February of 2017. And our average days on market last month was 68, 2017, 137. So that gives you kind of an idea of how different our market is right now. Single family attached units, last month we sold 50, 15, uh, in 2017 we sold 22, but the days on market last month were 45, 2017, 117 days on market. So that gives you kind of a perspective of, yes, the last couple of years have been very, very different as far as our normal market goes. So currently on the market, um, I also do absorption rates, with tell, which tells us how many months of inventory we have, which translates into whether we're in a seller's market or a buyer's market. Currently for single family detached houses, we have 210 houses listed on the market. Of those, 82 are active and 128 are under contract. Now when I do, when I, when I calculate absorption rate, I take into account both active and under contract properties because the under contract properties have not sold yet. And if I take that into account going back three months, we have 3.3 months of inventory. Now that being said, there's usually not such a huge differential between, you know, it's usually kind of the opposite. There's more active on the market and less contingent on the market. So if I take away the properties that are under contract and just calculate those that are active, we have 1.3 months of inventory on the market for single family detached. Now attached houses, again, we have 87 active on the market. Of those, 23 are active and 64 are under contract. So about three times as many, a little bit less than that, under contract. If I take all of those into account, we have a three, also a 3.3 months of inventory. But if I take away those that are under contract, 0.9 months of inventory. So we're still very, very tight, to say the least. Spring is coming. Um, I think I'm gonna be doing a video addressing um, uh, interest rates here in the next couple of weeks. I have been kind of slacking on my supplemental videos and only doing my, um, my market videos. 
So I know I need to kind of catch up a little bit on that, but the interest rates have been behaving a little differently than the industry anticipated this year. So I'm gonna address that a little bit. So stay tuned for that. And if you have any questions about the market, please don't hesitate to let me know. I'm always here. I can always answer those questions for you if you want a different county, if you want a specific neighborhood, specific price range, if you want a market analysis for your house to see where your value is. No pressure, no nothing, I'll just do one for you. So you know, because it's part of your portfolio and it's good to know what your, your home is worth, right? So message me, DM, whatever you call it, text me, email me, all that good stuff. I hope you have a fabulous week. Thank you for watching. I hope these videos are helpful. Please don't hesitate to share them out so the whole world knows how fabulous Montague County is. And you're fabulous too. Have a great day. Bye-bye.